Hey guys, it's Steve here from A470RC Soaring and uh, today uh, I'm up at the bulk uh, here in South Wales. Uh, it's not a bad day. It was lovely and sunny when, when I left home, but there's a bit of cloud here. Uh, but it's dry and um, it's looking like it's a good day, uh, weather-wise anyway. Uh, no rain in the forecast. Um, the winds are coming from the northwest and I believe they're due to swing around to westerly this afternoon. So we'll have a look and see what happens. Um, but we're heading out over, over that way. Um, there's somebody out there flying already at the moment. Um, so we're going to, I'm going to go and join him. I'm waiting for another one of the guys and uh, he'll be here shortly, I'm sure. And um, let's go do a bit of flying.
Just hopefully there's enough wind. Otherwise I'm right in the crap. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, so there we go. That's the session done. See my new friend here? <laughs> Frank. That's, that's Frank the sheep. <laughs> okay, so it wasn't quite what I was expecting it to be. Um, when I looked at the forecast last night, uh, it was showing uh, northwesterly moving around to westerly and the wind speed was going to be around oh 15 miles an hour and i thought well that'll be great because it'll be 20 miles an hour on the slope didn't turn out like that so it was stayed northwesterly and i measured the speed and it was sort of between 11 and 13 miles an hour and we did have a few periods where the wind speed did pick up for a few minutes and then it would drop back off again um, so I flew the polecat and uh, that flew pretty well and um, if I flew that on Mayo in 13 mile an hour it wouldn't have flown as well um, as it did this time uh, but anyway it was flying flying okay there was no ballast in in the polecat uh, so yeah that was good <clears throat> I did chance it launching the L213 and as you saw it was launched and the, the nose was going down and i thought i think it's probably got enough airspeed now so i went to give it a bit of elevator and and as i did it tip stalled and went in well that's the way it goes fortunately there's no damage it was absolutely fine i've checked it over thoroughly and and it's good to go um I did chance it. I shouldn't have done really. Um, but I did think that if there was enough lift for, for me to keep it in the air, because I didn't think the polecat would fly in that wind, but it did. Um, but I thought if, if there's enough, just enough slope lift, then hopefully I can get, get it up in, in a thermal. And, uh, but it wasn't to be. So I'm gonna have to wait. Um, uh, David was here as well. Um, and he was flying his Vladimir uh, Sprite Hot. Yeah, the Sprite Hot. Um, <laughs> he said, we've had some periods where we've come up here and there's not been much wind. Um, back, in, back in the day, a few years ago, there was always wind up here. You know, you never needed a, you rarely needed a light model up here, but, um, well, that's the way it seemed anyway. But these days it seems that uh, the winds are, a bit lighter so he was fed up of coming up here and there not being enough wind to fly so he decided to splash out and get this uh, sprite hot uh, and that flew really well <laughs> and uh, there was another guy already up here not met him before but he's a local guy and uh, he'd got a, uh, a foamy phoenix and uh, he was flying that well yeah it's going great anyway now uh this is the last video for a couple of weeks uh, by the time this one is published on the youtube um i shall be on my my holidays when it's when it's published and uh, so there'll be a couple of weekends when i'm not going to be able to fly um but uh it, so it'll probably be a, another video in about three weeks time so um anyway it was nice to get out come up to the bulk, do a bit of flying. It's what Sundays are for, isn't it? <laughs> right, guys, um, until the next time, take care and um, happy flying. <laughs>